All right, everybody. Welcome back to the Golf Club 2019. Uh, and I'm going to do the fourth round of a society event. Uh, I joined the Apex Times Club. It's the YouTuber I watch who also plays the game. Um, it's the fourth round in it. And when I record these, it'll probably only be the fourth round. Because it's, of course, four rounds if I'm doing the fourth. Um, and people seem to be overly good, or they're just using, uh, custom assists, which is, like, spin and, uh, hitting from closer tees and stuff like that, so, but we don't do that. So, uh, so people are able to get incredibly low scores. Uh, you can post messages and stuff, I do not do that. Uh, currently, I am minus six. That's the leader. That's what they finished anyway, I believe. Uh, first round, I was minus one. Second round, minus three. Third round, I was minus two. But I was minus four at one point. Um, that's what we were throughout the day. Um, the total is minus six. We'll get into it and uh, start the round. Starting it from the blue tees. And it's a pretty cool, pretty fun course. It's not way too hard. It's not way too easy. Um, the first round I didn't do too good because, of course, you know, it's been almost a week since I played it. So I had to get back into it. Did a bunch of practice swings and stuff like that. But, uh, yeah, not doing too bad. The hardest thing, really, ah, is that right there, the approaches. That, that approach was actually alright, it was pretty good, but I hit it slow, I pushed, pulled it to the left a little bit, and that, I pulled my putt. I keep, uh, I keep pulling stuff. So I need to, uh, need to start doing that a little better. But as you can see, first place is minus 53, but... You know, I consider it good if I'm not over par. And that's, to be honest, that's how it should be. So I'm pretty sure that whoever is, the people who are way up there are using assists. But who cares? As long as we have fun, right? Ooh, almost went in the rough. That was almost too far. Just because of the wind, I think. There's The wind's been pretty, pretty high on this tournament. See, we'll put it right there. Downhill, wind's going forward. It's slow again, which means it'll go to the right. But we stayed off the green, unfortunately. I'll go ahead and put it. Because it's a lot easier to get these putts close than a chip. As you can see, we made the putt. And now we're minus seven on the total, and today we're minus one. So that's almost how I started the third round. I birdie, birdie, and then I think I parred and then started bogeying a couple. Hopefully on this one. Ooh, that was slow. Now slow means uh, it won't go as far, but I pulled it left as well. But that's fine. As long as we stay in the fairway. Ah. Yeah, I wasn't... Because sometimes, you know, you get that roll, that insane roll that you shouldn't be getting. But sometimes you don't, and we don't seem to be getting it. So I can probably... Ooh, pushed it. Maybe if I hadn't pushed it right, would have made it. I can probably play it like a... Uh, almost a real-life round. Um, the one thing that they do, though, that I wish they would fix is... You can hit any wedge you want with how much uh, loft you want, and it might have a little backspin on it, but it never comes backwards like from where it was, which is really odd because in you know real life, you get backspin and it comes back. That was a pretty good shot. Now I did pull it a little left. I might not have hit it. Nope. 
I know I didn't hit it hard enough. There we go. And I guess, unless I get a request not to fast forward the shots, I'll be fast forwarding the shots just because that's what I'm used to. And since I play by myself, it doesn't really matter. Ooh, that just hooked left. And didn't stay in the fairway. If it stayed in the fairway, we could have went for it. But there's a big-ass tree in the way, and for some reason it wants me to pitch it. Well, we can still make it there, though. We'll just aim it about right here. Or, let's see. Uh, we'll, yeah, we'll aim right there and play a big draw on it. Slow, but that's all right. Ooh, okay. Whew. That was the right shot to play. We hit it. Damn near perfect. Okay, so we do not want to pitch a 9-iron because that thing will roll forever. What we'll do is we'll pitch a pitching wedge and put a little bit of loft on it and hope that doesn't run forever. That was slow, so it went to the right. And it didn't go anywhere for some reason. Ooh. Missed it to the right. But, good thing, it's a par 5. So we parted. We didn't lose any... We didn't lose anything. Didn't gain anything, but... It's alright. My goal is to get to minus 10, which is three more birdies. And no bogeys. Alright, perfect, perfect. Did pull it a little bit. And it went in the rough, of course. <sighs> It's alright though, it's light rough. It's light rough. It's uphill, in the rough. So I'm gonna do that and put just a little bit of loft. Perfect, perfect. Now it pulled it just a touch left. Will it sit? No. But again, it was in the rough, so you wouldn't have too much stop on it. I pulled it. Oh, whew. made it anyway. That's another birdie. Only two more to go for my little goal. I think maybe... Oh, wow. A long one. We'll go... Right here. We have the wind maybe helping us out. Don't hit the green. That's probably going to run. Well, no. It didn't run too bad, so maybe... You know, maybe but I don't know what the hell I was trying to say there, but... Maybe on the society event, the... Oh, yes. Another birdie. The greens might, he might have made them a little soft for us. So that'd be good. When they're playing softer, that's, that's nice. Because then they'll stop a lot quicker. And you can actually play for a shot instead of just hope. Alright, pulled it a little bit, but that should be fine. All right, so uphill, downwind. Probably gonna go another club with a little loft. Ooh, all right. That was the right thing to do. Be I should have put just a touch more loft on it, but it would have been really hard to stop it close to the hole. Ah, yeah, I didn't put enough on it and I pulled it a little bit. But like I said, uh, until things happen at, uh, at work, these videos will be a little sporadic. So, you know, I'm going to try to re record a couple of, uh, of career tournaments. Ah, damn. Push to the right. So that I can post them throughout the week. Because they're pretty quick to make. They're fun to make as well. Let's see. It's light rough. I'm not going to use a driver. That's insane. Light rough. Uh, we're going to aim it about right here. Put a good amount of fade on there. 
Ooh, I put too much fade. It went in that stupid bunker. Um, but I want to be able to post them throughout the week. Uh, that for some reason did not work out. See, that is still something that happens that I don't like in the game. The, uh, uh, we'll just go full chip on this. Yeah, it worked out. The sand shots, if it's a full shot, for some reason, even if you get it perfect, it still doesn't seem to go the right distance. Like, if I can hit my pitching wedge out of the sand, 130 or not a sand but a normal pitching wedge out of the fairway 130 then I should be able to at least hit it out of the sand I'm gonna say 125 you know maybe not the full 130 damn still in the rough but uh that cut it off like almost 15 yards I don't know why I will right, we'll go up a club because it's heavy rough very slow for some reason Still in the green, but we gotta go over a little tier, so that sucks. Ooh, 44 foot putt. We gotta play it like a 60 footer. It's breaking a little right, but not too much. Oh, wow. Cannot believe that. We made a 40 foot putt. Blah. 40 foot uphill putt. Can't talk. And we're minus 10, which was my goal. Now we just need to stay there. If we can go lower, that'd be nice. But I'm just going to try to stay there. Oh, wow. I've gone in the water two out of the four rounds. Okay. Yeah, two out of the four rounds I've gone in the water because I hit it right. So, yeah, thank God I didn't this time. I will put a little loft on this. And just hit a full chip. There we go. Another birdie. Just gotta play it safe. Play it safe and you'll get birdies on the birdie holes. Par 5, short par 4s. And then once in a while, you know, you hit just a great shot on a par 3 or something. Or a longer par 4 and birdie that as well. Alright, it's uphill, but the wind is also up. So I'm just gonna put a little loft on it. I hit it slow, which means it'll go right. Sit. Ooh, that. Almost hit that pin. But that one is another one where unless you hit that rough in front of the green, it's going to be really hard to get it anywhere near the hole. I feel like that was tracking pretty good, but just didn't hit it. But like I said, you play safe like that. You know, I knew I would, unless I really messed up and hit it very slow or hit it slow on the backswing, that... I was going to get somewhere on the green. You know, I didn't need to go down a club, less loft, and try to hit it in the rough so it would get next to the hole. That's insane. That's a one in a thousand shot. Now this is a hybrid. I'm going to place it about right here. Play a little bit of fade. Perfect, perfect, but that was... Wow. Wow. For some reason, that fade went dead straight. I don't understand that. But then you have stuff like that happen. A shot that should have been, to be honest, really, really good. Ended up horrible because it just didn't do what it was supposed to do. But luckily, it was... It's a par 5. We got it around the green on our second shot. Pitched it up to a nice shot, uh, spot on our third was able to tap in for a birdie. Now, to be honest, my favorite hole on this course is probably the 18th, and uh, I'll tell you why when we get there, but oof, I really do like the layout of a lot of these holes. Alright, let's go up another club, because it is uphill. Ooh. Yeah, I pushed it to the right. Or else it would have been on point with the hole. Uh, it's not looking like too much break. Ooh, and it was not, and we made the... Wow. 
Alright. I guess I'm getting better. Oh wow, I accidentally skipped the entire leaderboard. I mean, we're nowhere near it, but whatever. So I like to see when I move up a little bit, you know. Our 11 mile. The wind doesn't seem to affect things too much besides, uh. If it's down or up. Damn, I pushed it to the right. Would have been perfect. Now, if the wind's coming back or if the wind's helping you, it'll affect it. But other than that, it really does not affect it too much, like it going left or right. Go ahead and try and chip this out the bunker. Ooh. Alright, that ended up actually really good. As in real life, just like in this game, those shots are really tough. And in real life, of course, you don't just you don't chip out of a bunker. But this game, sand shots are a little funny. It, well, it's flop shots are a little funny, I should say. And fairway. But on the par threes, you just you go for the par and hope for a birdie. Now it's uphill and the wind's going down, so we're going to take another club, but we're going to put some loft on it. Because it's a hybrid, so it's going to go a little further, and I pulled it left, but it's a little far anyway. It's a pretty long par 4, though, 499. There we go. Should be, yeah, it should be decent. I mean... I didn't hit it again, but when you got a long putt like that, it's it's pretty hard to judge how hard you want to hit him. Ah, I keep skipping it. <laughs> ah, this hole is really nice too, because if the wind's going, if the, if the wind is with you, you really uh, have to decide if you want to try and go for a uh, fade. You know, and not getting that rough, go three wood to avoid the rough. And you got to remember to go left so you don't get in that water. Now, the gap wedge pitch, I'm going to go a tiny bit aloft because they seem to be stopping on these greens. Yeah. I just pulled it a little bit. Oh. Ooh, we made it. Doing really good this round. I'm minus 8 on the day. That is really good for me. Minus 14 on the round, whatever. You know, minus 14 on a whole tournament is really good. These people that are in first place. I'm telling you. See, this, this is the hole I love. And let's, let's go ahead and look at it again. A nice looking stream through the whole thing. Now you get up here, if the wind is not in your face like it is now, you can go for that. But because that wind's in your face, you cannot. Instead, we're going to go back down to our three wood. Well, we're hoping not to do that. I don't believe that should have been slow, but whatever. We're going to go pitch and wedge. There we go. Just get it out somewhere, you know, a good distance so I have, you know, not too, I didn't want to have this long of a shot into the hole, but I do, so it's fine. It's fast, so it'll be a little left, but it seems okay, just maybe a little long. Yeah. A chance for a birdie, but again, getting in that bunker the way we were, we're really just playing for a par anyway. I put, pulled it again, so yeah, we got, we're going to get the par. And to be honest, probably the worst played hole I've had this round. And so we finish off the day at minus 8, and the tournament at minus 14 in 113th place because people are ridiculously stupidly either good or using really easy assists and get to minus 63. Because the only way to get there, I feel like, is to play the way the early Tiger Woods games played. You had spin, you had all this crazy stuff on it, you could play, you know, the forward tees, but whatever. Minus 14, I feel, is really good. 
And this level, I don't think does anything except give you stuff, so I don't see the reason for the for the levels. But I played really good that one, and I'll go ahead and rate the course five because I think the course is really good. And let's see, minus 63. Oh, okay, damn. Yeah, exactly. Let's see, there's far too many I explained how at length before on YouTube. I don't know what this person is talking about. But, uh, no, oh, no PC crossplay. Yeah. Uh, PlayStation isn't allowing crossplay, at least right now. Uh, it's probably money reasons. That's how it always is. But, uh, hope you enjoyed the last event of the society. Uh, another one pops up in two days, so I'll make sure to get the last round of that on there. Um, the next video will be the PG Tour career, and it will be... I can't remember where we're at, actually, but we'll find out when we get there. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a great day, and bye.